So the third group that we're interested in here are muscles that go from the scapula to the humerus. And this is known as the muscular cuff or the rotator cuff, sometimes called the sits muscles because of their initials. Um, if you're going to take them in order, you want to call them the tis muscles because down here there's teres minor, which comes from the scapula to the back of the humerus. Above that there's infraspinatus, which both of which help to pull the humerus back. At the top, above the spine of the scapula, there's supraspinatus, which works with deltoid as an abductor. And underneath the scapula, and coming round and attaching to the front, is subscapularis. So quite a deep muscle, but an important one for being released. So there's the four muscles there that bind the head of the humerus into the cavity of the shoulder joint.